when an issuer is selling its own securities, it's subject to a different um, regulatory regime. If you liked this video, click below. And if you want to see more videos like this, click subscribe and then remember to click the little bell icon so you get notifications. Enormous uh, concentration of power. Democracy, poverty reduction, and cryptocurrency. Are you sophisticated enough to um, invest in uh, securities? Bitcoin is actually a reversion to commodity money. Decentralized social networking. One thing I wanted to ask is there's the issuer exemption where essentially a broker dealer is someone who is reselling the securities for one reason or another. Just to be uh, for the audience, correct me if I'm wrong. A broker is someone who essentially brokers a deal between two parties. A dealer is someone who trades for their own account. So they may be a market maker of some sort or something like that. And an issuer is neither one because the issuer is is not connecting two parties. They're selling something that they have issued. And they're also, unless they're buying it back, uh, are not a dealer. So the definition might get a little fuzzy if you have private deals to buy back your own stocks or your own securities, but it doesn't make you a dealer. Uh, how is it because it's a one-off, like when corporations buy their own stocks or something like that? Well, the, 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 thing, the thing is that um, when an issuer is selling its own securities, it's subject to a different um, regulatory regime. It's got to fit, you know, you've, the, the sale itself has got to fit within a uh, registered transaction or one of the exemptions like 506C or Reg, Reg CF or Reg A. And so they don't need to be treated. They're not doing it for other people. They're doing it for themselves. If you want to see more videos like this, click subscribe and then remember to click the little bell icon so you get notifications. Wintercoin, making crypto mainstream.